Hello everybody, it's Gladiator here, back with another video, and today I'm going to be showing you how to get the Lifesteal SMP plugin on Eternos. So let's just hop into it. First things first, we want to go to Eternos.org, uh, and then we want to hit play, then we want to sign in. Okay, so here we are on the server, and first thing we want to do is we want to install Spigot. Um, so just install it, just add um, a software, and click Spigot, and then install the latest version. Um, keep in mind, um, you don't need Spigot if you're doing 1.16.5, but if you're doing 1.17 uh, and higher, then you need to use Spigot, um, just because the, per uh, the uh, um, creator hasn't updated it. So first thing we want to do is we want to go to plugins and we just want to search up life steel and then this will come up. You just want to click it and download it. So this is really easy um to do. And uh so here it is. It's already there. And first we need to start it. So while it's starting, I just want to talk about um uh the like pluses and minuses of Eternos. Okay, so um, so the pluses of Eternos is you can have as many people on your server as you want. So, <laughs> so yeah, uh, that's insane. Um, you can do that, but the problem is it takes a year, like literally almost a year or something, to like start the server, and it's kind of annoying um to be waiting for a while. So for that reason, I wouldn't recommend it. But it also has one touch um or one click uh installs for plugins a lot of plugins so that's the only reason like a small plugin like the lsvl smp plugin is on there because it's fan made too uh so another plus about this or um yeah so that's pretty much it but um i w if you're like um oh here it is it started uh if you're like a person that doesn't really play that much and you're playing by yourself on the server or with a few friends and they only play when you play and they don't play a lot then Eternos is really good but if you have like a server like um like the one I'm uh, making and I'm taking applications for um that's a lifestyle SMP uh, server you have to be a YouTuber to join and you have to upload every once a week or twice a week something like that um anything is fine like that but you need to always record when you get on and you just want to it's just a really fun time we'll add other plugins like uh no combat log uh maybe origins smp no who knows uh things like that um i'll leave the link to the video that i made um in the description go check that out if you're a youtuber and you want to like grow with us other youtubers i have 95 subscribers as uh, as of currently, Hypocritical is like 115 or something. Pengi is 14. He's still growing. Um, and we're going to have a lot of creators on there. So if you want a chance to grow and you're willing to um, edit and record every time you get on the server, um, then definitely join. Um, we're taking applications. Uh, so <laughs> without, without further ado, um, it started up the server. So now we need to check um, files. And the first thing we want to do is go to plugins, and then it made this folder. So we want to open it, and we want to change a couple things in the config. So first thing we want to change is um, if the person dies, they should spectate. it. That's true. I like that. Um, but if they do get banned, and they probably won't, it should broadcast. I don't want them to get banned, but I'll just set this to true if I ever want them to get banned. Um, this is should ban false. I have that. I like that. And uh, if you die to like lava, fall damage, anything like that with the environment, then you lose a heart. You can set this to true or false. I'm setting it as true. Uh, now I can sa save this. And the next thing I want to do is change the recipe. So now in recipes, the first thing I want to do is I want to show how to change the actual recipe. So to understand this, this is supposed to be a crafting table right here. And uh, y you just assign an item to a variable, and you just put the variable in each place of the crafting table. So that's how that works. And if you uh, want to add one more, um, another variable, then you want to um, copy just one of these and make sure you get that comma at the end. 
uh, and then you want to just come here paste it after this and then you can delete the comma but here for this one since I have another one I need to continue it so comma comma and then you end it here so um, you can just change this to whatever you want the variables can be whatever you want uh, based on your recipe and for my recipe I want to do gold blocks on the corners um, or gold block on the corners and I want to have a totem underscore of underscore undying as uh, like the middle part so I want to have a totem in the middle gold blocks on the side so this is for the crafting recipe um, and then diamond blocks in the middles and that's how I think I want it to be um, so I'm going to save this and I am going to restart the server really quick um so yeah so while it's restarting I just wanted to say thank you for all the recent support um my mine hut video on this is actually popping off it has like 500 views and now I'm at 95 subscribers it would mean the world to me if I could get 100 um by the end of let's say this year because this year is almost over um so yeah that's pretty much it so let's just wait for this to start up okay so we're on minecraft and uh... now what we want to do um... is uh... we need to test the limits of this plugin so time hold on let me time set it um, okay, so first things first, we want to test is uh, like dying to the environment slash mobs. So let's just add this mob over here. Hope it doesn't die before. And as you can see, we lost a heart now. So uh, let's check this one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine hearts now. And to show if I die, oh, I didn't die to the creeper. Um, let me show it right here. Uh, if I go like right here. Um, if I just go right here. Yeah, like right here. Um, it will lose another heart for me. Oh, there's a creeper there. I wish I'd. Okay. And now I lost another one heart. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight hearts now. Um, so as you can see, that works. So now what we want to do is we want to craft back our hearts, obviously. So um, either we could kill somebody or we could craft our hearts. Um, you can set the recipe to whatever you want. I just set it to what I wanted. So our crafting table is first. Let's get one of those. And then diamond block. I'm just going to get 64 of them. Gold block. 64 of them. And we need totems. And I'm going to grab two because we lost two hearts. So now to show that is uh, we're just going to place on that crafting table. Go inside the crafting table. And we want to do the recipe. For me, the recipe is this. Just like that. And there we go. An extra heart. So now if I apply it and I go to slash game mode survival, as you can see, it gave me one back, a heart back, three, four, six, seven, eight, nine. So now I need to craft, actually I can do this in survival, survival, um, craft another heart and I can add it. And as you can see, my hearts went up by one. So now, um, as you can see, that works. So just do those things, and um, it should work. So uh, I think that's the end of the video. Thank you guys for all the support. I know I've said this a couple of times. It's getting annoying, but so um, thank you guys so much. Um, and if you like this video, drop a like, subscribe, um, and uh, in the comments, just ask me for more content or more um, uh, more uh, or like ask me for different like. Give me ideas to do videos on. 
Uh, I got this idea um, from one of my awesome commenters, and uh, <laughs> um, I just did it. So if you wanna, if you need something um, to be explained to you or need to figure out something, um, then just ask me, and uh, I will try to make a video on it. Um, so without further ado. Um, thank you guys for watching. Please subscribe and join my um, I Still Awesome P if you are a YouTuber who's looking to grow. And uh, I will see you guys all next time. Goodbye.